Hello everyone, welcome to this YouTube channel. Myself Roslyn and in this video we will discuss about how we can set or customize the y-axis interval in the Power BI stack bar chart. So these are the headings that we are going to cover in this video. First we will see how we can customize or set the range of the y-axis interval in the Power BI stack bar chart visual. In the same way in addition we will see how we can set the zero values in the stack bar chart visual. So let's begin. Before that we have to know it is possible to set the y-axis interval in the stack bar chart visual or not. Yes, it is possible. We can easily customize the y-axis range interval like 1200, 1400 and etc. as per our requirement. Now we will see an example how we can set the y-axis interval in the stack bar chart visual in Power BI. Initially, open the Power BI disk and load the data using the get data option presented under the home tab. Once the data has been loaded, in the data view, we can view the data. In this section, I have already loaded financials table data, product set A table data and the sales table. Here we are going to use the financial step data table. Now select the report view and in the visualization pan select the stack bar chart and align it properly. Now simply drag and drop the fields into the field section. In the y axis field I am going to drag and drop the discounts field and in the x axis profit field so that here you can see the stack bar chart visual displays the profit value by discounts. If you want to add the legend in this section I am going to add the country field so that it displays the profit value and discounts by country. Now this is how the stack bar chart looks like. To change the range of the y axis here you can see it starts from 0k, 50k, 100k and 150k. To set or customize the y axis interval simply go to the format your visual. Select the visual and go to the format option. Expand the y axis. Here you can see the type is continuous and the range value we can see by minimum and maximum. By default default it is in the auto mode so to set the range simply enter the values in the minimum range value and the maximum range value in the selected text field in the formula field. so here i am going to enter the minimum range as 1000 and the maximum range value as 2000 so here you can see the y axis interval has been changed like 1000 1200 1400 till 2000 it is displaying in the stack bar chart visual so this is how we can easily customize or set the range value for the y axis interval. If you want to delete or revert the changes simply we can click reset to default option so that it displays the default value which we already saw. In this case I am going to set an interval between 1000 to 200 in the y axis. So I am going to leave it as it is. Now we will see how we can show zero values in the stack bar chart visual in y axis. In the same way select the stack bar chart visual here and then drag and drop the fields into the field section. Here I am going to display the sales value and the profit value based on the country. Here you can see the stack bar chart visual looks like this. Now to show the zero values in the y axis field to start from 0 k okay, here select the stack bar chart visual go to the format your visual pan expand the y axis and here by default it is in the auto values for the minimum range and the maximum range. We have to set the minimum range to 0 so that it starts from the 0 value. In the same way I am going to set the maximum value as 1000. Here you can see the y axis interval shows from 0, 200, 400, 600, 800 and 1000. This is how we can show 0 values by customizing the ranges for the y axis section. With this we came to the end of this video where we have learned how to customize the y axis interval. Thanks for watching this video and these are the free video tutorials that are presented in our YouTube channel. Please check it out and please do subscribe to our YouTube channel for more videos.